Hey guys, it's Lina from the Land of Gods, and we are doing right now the monthly map spread for the sign of Cancer, my Krabby Crab Crabs for the month of August. Guys, please remember these are general reading times, fluid, and energies can be reversed. This wants to come out even before the shuffle is finished. No problem, cards want to speak. As I was saying, times fluid energies can be reversed. Take what resonates, leave the rest for others to receive. If you're here for the first time, welcome aboard. Welcome to my channel. And if you've been kind enough to come back, thank you so very much. Welcome back, guys. The monthly map spread started in June. And what we are doing here is basically looking into or tapping into uh, different energies. What's up in the month, how they are interacting with each other. We're not just focusing on one energy, but trying to look at things from a wider lens. So I think we are ready. Yes, we are. Let's see, crabs. We already know from where we are starting. Temptation indulgence i hear we gotta be a little more mindful crabbies we might be right now over indulging in something there's something that is tempting us there is something that we might not really be in balance with let us see what more comes our way ace of waters has somebody scooped us off the ground or something or are we trying to do that is someone too charming to resist there is major temptation here and i'm not saying that it is something wrong or bad it's just a caution that is given to you right now a sort of soft warning that take it slow this i feel is for a few someone new coming in someone who's extremely enticing very exciting someone who is as i said too charming the charms are like off the roof right now and you can't help but feel attracted to this energy Ace of Waters, this is like a lot of lust coming along as well. King of Fire, look, I'm telling you, this whosoever is there in the scene right now is supremely charming, very charismatic, very, very charismatic. You are told to kind of be a little more careful because you feel like, you know, being drifted in the current and there is no sense of control over your emotions you're all over the place crabbies you are all over the place this is like having no control whatsoever it's almost very giddy i feel you know like very high schooly transformation this could be someone who is coming in when you were least expecting this person to come in or you are yourself in some kind of a shift in energy and there comes this very tempting very charismatic very charming energy and you are completely taken aback you've been taken off guard clearly and it somehow is as strange as it sounds all kind of divinely conspired for something that is needed in life which either you know already or you will eventually get to know justice i'm telling you you are told again and again to treat with caution and bring in some balance within yourself because it feels like you are just being so wooed by this energy, by this king of fire that there is no balance whatsoever. It feels like high on hormones, teenage 
vibe here two of waters lots of love lots of love lots of very hard sessions i'm telling you that i feel a lot of lust here a lot of in a good way i'm not saying in a bad way i'm just saying that you need to find some grounding in this connection it's just you being on that bike without any brakes so you do not want to land up in a crash okay it's just too much too soon too good to be true kind of a feeling but you do not know why you just cannot stop yourself five of air this whatever delicate balance that is needed you are told that you know uh, do not land up losing your inner integrity because you were like yeah let's see where it goes you know just know that whatever you are doing you can go off balance and this is gonna land up in a lot of injury a lot of heartache i hear eight of fire that my love is you guys need to talk you guys have lots and lots of fire there's just so much oh my god there is so much heat i feel right now it's like you know insane carnal energy there is a lot of that very wild animal craving for each other that i feel lots of heat but let's also give each other time to express how you feel what your you know passions are besides being in bed with each other um <laughs> you know where do you see yourself going what you feel is your purpose all of that try and get to a deeper connection and while you would try and do that you will know whether this person just needs lots of fun which you are also having not saying that you're not so it's mutual clearly there's nobody using nobody you both like each other but can this go further can this deepen at least see where it can go you know it's a very rabbity phase going on four of waters there's love that has come to you in a very very unexpected way that is clear that is very much clear i need some for this eight of fire four of air we have yeah take a breather loves breathe take a breather we need to hold on to our horses i hear hold on to your horses you're just this is too fast this is too fast for anybody to be in a comfort zone for too long if you want this long term gotta take it a little slow you know a notch down we have the king of waters in the reverse so as i was saying i'm not really sure whether this king of fire this very passionate very charismatic being uh, who has entered your life quite suddenly truly wants to take it further to the deeper levels so you don't land up feeling that you wasted your time or your emotions just see where it's going okay this energy is too strong you are literally being swiped clean 10 of air for some this is a rebound a very very tempting rebound a very very passionate rebound and we got strength here we got to as i said you know 
pull back. It takes quite a bit when you are having such a good time to think like that because you're like, hey, let's go with the flow. So is this dude or girl, whosoever, this energy. But you do not want to land up being hurt in the near future. So just save yourself from that crash, okay? Page of Waters. Yeah, I'm telling you, there's a lot of passion in there. There's a lot of like, you know, that high school energy. There's a lot of, let's see where it goes from here. Ace of Earth. We do have two aces here. This is the new beginning and this has a lot of passion. You need to see where there is a chance of some grounding here. There is a chance of something, you know, more long term here. And you will get to know only if you talk to each other, not just having a good time, but see if this connection can go further. Page of fear. Yeah, we need to bring in some truths. We need to look into more information. We are just being driven by passion so much so that our basic common sense is lacking right now. Crabbies. You are water. I know. Sometimes it's like emotions can take you by surprise and you are like in the eye of the storm right now. In a good way. I'm not saying that this is something that, you know, it's a complete no-go. You shouldn't really. Nah, -uh, who am I to say that? I'm just saying just be a little more cautious, okay? Just be more mindful and aware what's happening with you to you it feels like right now it's happening but you need to know what is happening with you right now and yeah don't get carried away let's clarify people quite a bit here already moon emotions are high and a lot of things are hidden there's more to this person than what meets the eye and I am not sure whether this is something that you will be happy about when you'll find. There's a very Casanova vibe to this person. Ten of Cups, you are so freaking happy. You guys are having such good times. You don't even want to think like that. Like, yeah, so what? From Ace of Cups to the Ten of Cups, you really feel like, you know... Why? Why do I have to, you know, look at it from this mature adult lens? Why can't I just, you know, have some good time here? Sure, nobody is telling not to have a good time. But that good time might land up soon into some kind of a conflict of interest because you would want probably more. I have five of sword twice here. It's a very delicate balance, as I said you might want more and this person might not be in a position to give more and you do not want your heart broken do you you do not want to feel the grief or you do not want to feel like you've been used or you do not want to feel like you know you wasted your time and emotions because at the end of the day this is all mutual here emperor I'm telling you, this person has quite a hold on you. This person definitely has quite a hold on your psyche, on the way you are. You, you aren't usually not this way. But with this person, you have completely surrendered. This emperor is taking me to that king of fire. So charming, you are bamboozled by this person. Queen of Wands, King of Wands. There is so much fire here, dude. Seriously, what is up? Look, we have the Ace of Wands. It's just insane passion. It's just so much heat. This is like really carnal animal freaking jungle Tarzan love happening right now. Dang, so much sex here. Yes. Five of Cups. Look, five of Waters here. I'm telling you. Be careful, crabs. This is just a lot that you might land up regretting in future. So why to put yourself in that position? Your angels are like, 
giving you these warnings right now this is really kind of a hashtag red flags this is caution hierophant clearly maybe in this as well there is a lot of learning and this person might be older than you there might be a big age gap i feel irrespective whether you are elder or this person is elder though i'm taken to that king of fire and in this deck especially the king of fire is a really old learned charming man so yeah this man knows or this energy knows what this energy is doing and what for this energy is in you don't you don't look there's so much of celebration so much of good times who the hell cares what's up what's gonna be in the future let me have some good time people let the champagne flow man like seriously there would be i feel or there are already some of your well-wishers some of your friends telling you hey man seriously just calm yourself down it's like today you are here tomorrow you are planning packing your bags and leaving for a trip it's like just they just can't wrap their head around this that it's not you what are you doing this person has completely just switched off your headspace your logic button has been switched off this person has you wrapped around his finger or her fingers wow yeah there are people who are warning you look devil i mean how much more heat do we need in this this is literally animals being in their heat season it's just insane carnal passion there's a lot of lot of lot of sex here but seriously every time you want to talk to this person you want to you know go a little deeper than just superficial level this person just you know turns looks straight into your eyes just gives you a very passionate kiss and you are back in bed and off goes that talk that you wanted to have and connect my god this person has a lot of authority maybe this person is also you know very very successful and you are completely just bamboozled by this person two of cups passion 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 everywhere two of cups coming in again dang i mean who would not want this but Everybody around you, your friends, your well-wisher, your families, your angels, they are like scared for you. <laughs> they are. Ten of pentacles. This person has a lot of money. Yeah, very charming. Got some dough. Stands in a place of authority. Is also probably um, elder to you very accomplished very successful person look seven of swords just came in my hand literally there is a lot of deception in a way this person is not sharing all this person is not telling you about himself at all it's like you know you have opened up to this person he knows you know what you did in sixth grade and who was your best friend in kindergarten and where you lived and everything about you but you don't even know their surname or from where they come or do they have even siblings or their family you know nothing about this person you just know how good they are in bed that's all you really need to be mindful seriously people we have the nine of pentacles i'm telling you this person has quite a bit of money this person might just leave you hanging you do not want that you do not need that you need to go slow people knight of pentacles take that time out thing from a different view look at it from the lens of your well-wishers and not just through so much of passion and love that's come in it's just so much of carnal 
energy that's coming in page of cups yeah you are in that you know very giddy very high schooly high on hormones phase clearly you're not in high school you guys need to be treating with supreme caution i hear man so much passion here this is one of the most heated spread that i've had for anybody for that matter man i remember long back there was a spread for leos but man this is just at a different level altogether let's get you an oracle guidance message to wrap up this reading this one's from the yogic paths oracle deck one of the most beautiful and my early ones look kali and durga oh my god two extremely extremely strong deities here two very very strong goddesses in the hindu mythology let us first read durga and then kali kali is the one who destroys all the evil by the way so you are told yeah keep your eyes open for that devil let's read durga first Goddess of inner strength and protection. That strength card coming in my head immediately. You are exhibiting great strength in the face of things that would make others, including former version of yourself, crumble. Durga, the warrior goddess, is with you carrying her bow and arrow, sword, trident, lotus, thunderbolt, right here, golden discus and conch. You are embodying her fierce strength and loving protection. You have overcome major hardships with your willpower and will continue to leap over any challenges that confront you. Call upon Drugama whenever you need an extra ounce of strength, which I feel right now you do need because you need to snap out of this whatever love potion that this person has made you drink. Like, seriously. Let us read Kali now. Goddess of destruction, dissolution and ecstasy. You draw upon Kali when you are in a time of radical rebirth. She's fierce, erratic, untamed. The part of you that you're afraid to give full control because you don't know where it will take you. I feel that carnal energy that is right now completely out of control is what this card is coming out to be. But Madhurga is here to tell you that you need to tap into your inner strength and protect your heart. Come on. It's just insane level of heat here. She will destroy all disillusion and bring you face to face with your darkest shadows, not to cause anguish, but rather from a deep place of love. Probably all of this happening right now is for you to also know your weaknesses. No? She demolishes the ego that creates the boundary between you and your higher self. She's the ecstasy experienced in an orgasm, meditation, bold self-expression, or pushing a child out of the womb. Kali comes to you in a time of deep liberation, which I feel you feel when you are with this person. That's the reason high on hormone, you know. Let's see where it goes. Kind of an energy that I feel. Just be cautious, that's all. Kali comes to you in a time of deep liberation, stepping into the truer form of you. Trust the process and allow yourself to release all limitations so you can become one with the bliss that you are. That you are not what this person is and make you feel that you are or how you feel with this person. You need to feel as happy, satisfied, high on energy, you know, the ecstatic 
energy that you feel with this person you need to feel this on your own and on that note my crabbies i'm gonna take your leave i thank you all for joining me it's a wrap namaste from the land of gods